everyone, I'm Round the Wheel, and you're watching Threads of Fate. Last time, the Book of Cosmos was destroyed, and we're going to see Athanasius. I don't like the sound of his name, but you can't judge a Book of Cosmos by its cover. So, yeah, who who is this guy? Oh, yes. Well, that would be an impediment to answering all the questions. But, you know, he just kind of hangs out. Death ain't really a thing with these... Aeon guys. I see. They really like sealing themselves in things, don't they? I mean, he might. You're a cool guy. You've attracted a lot of attention. And Okay, yeah. Alright, well, powerful and all-knowing. He's sounding a little better to me already. Oh! Oh-ho-ho! Ho. Sounds like he uh, heard he had guests. He is a freaky looking dude. Don't say anything about his head. Wow. Mr. All-Knowing does not know what is capable of such feet. Well, then we are definitely dealing with something bad here. Whoa, hey, wow. Want to throw me under the bus, why don't you? Uh-oh. Well, hey, whoa, hey. Well, it's not like that. I mean, give me a second to clarify. Um, whoa, hey. Hey, buddy. You just met me. How do you know that? Yeah, well, just looking at your wretched face disgusts me. I said don't say anything. Well, I guess, uh, merging with a book also makes you extremely crazy. Man, this guy, this guy has got some long-standing prejudices. I don't know anything about being no ser I am a servant to no man. Well, time to play Kill the Bigot, I guess. Because I don't like the way this guy is talking to me. I... What... You know what the fuck he's talking about? I don't I don't know. Oh really? <laughs> I can't even say relic in a dumb way there. He messed it up with his funky capitalization. And if you're gonna put a lower don't put a lowercase L and an uppercase next to each other. That's just tacky looking. <laughs> that that was very English sounding. Stop you at all cost! Yeah, it's too late. That guy, that guy is royally cheesed. He is a royale with cheese, and it sounds like we have to fight. Well, it, ow, hey, buddy. Hey, no hitting with the mustache. That is not fair. He takes damage. Whoa, hey. Oh, I don't like the smart bombs. Oh, come on now. Oh, and I got to start all the way over. Well, oh, ah, God, you funky butt-loving... Okay, yeah, I guess I should just let those things hit me because they don't actually hurt me that much. It's falling in the pit that does all the damage. Yeah, there we go. Oh, 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 he turned around. That's his big trick. His big trick is also knocking me into pits against my will. Okay, tiny platform. Tiny platform, you done been shrunk. Oh, boy, this is this is not turning out bueno. From, okay, how about not hitting me? Boy, he takes damage really easily, though. Do you ever, uh, oh yeah, probably don't get close to the face either. Ow, hey, whoa, send me flying across the arena here. Well, if I can get in a few decent hits, then, uh, wow, some all-powerful Aeon. That wasn't even my best work. Of course, then again, he did throw a lot of smart bombs at me. It seems like he had some weaker attacks than that with, like, electricity wave that would have been easy to jump over. I think your power is useless, sir. Well, we can keep doing this all day, I guess. I mean, I've got gold coins out the bazoo. <laughs> yes, your sovereign power that I just beat in one try. Oh shit, motherfucker! Uh, 
Well, clearly. I mean, we're not at, like, Kefka level here or anything, but still, that's pretty nutso in the butt. Yeah, don't bother. Rue couldn't beat him the first time. How am I going to beat him now? When he just sucked an Aeon into his face. Holy shit. Yeah, nuts to books. With a little help from me, of course. Oh, what? <laughs> that exact... Wow. Took the words right out of his stupid doll mouth. I mean, I didn't mean to help. Man, I feel like such a tool. Uh, I'm a thing? Uh, our, our threads of fate, if you will. This doesn't sound like something I signed up for. I don't like this one bit. His name was Valen, and he hung out inside a Windows Media Player visualization thingy. So Aeons aren't gods? That's weird-ish. Oh, man. I bet when you smoke it, it's awesome. Even logic and willpower are under the dominion of this relic. Well, that's a pretty good way to get promoted to God, sounds like. The Rue Prism. Because <laughs> it's in my face, you see. Ah, whatever. You don't appreciate a good joke. Tick. Talk. Tick. Talk. Tick. Well, I've got a chunk of it sitting in my head here, so advantage Rue sounds like. Man, truly I am a man of multitudes. Oh, so they kind of hi-yah karate chopped him. Ha-ha! <laughs> Side tackle! Unnecessary apostrophe! Boosh! Take that, Valen. These, uh, these PowerPoint transitions are very jarring in the middle of all this, incidentally. No! Well, I mean, like, sort of, no, but like, you know. You know, everybody, everybody's always hanging around out in space out here. You know how it goes. Not impregnable for long, considering the way this guy's going. Oh, so it's like a taunting. He's just waiting out the clock, waiting for all his friends to die so that he can come back and do the nasty. <laughs> yeah, like any minute now. Oh, okay. Well, biding our time, I see. A villain never reveals all his secrets at once. Like I said, if you are listening, which you're not, because you're stupid. Valen has sealed himself inside an impregnable dimension. It's a very tiny dimension, gotta say. Well, <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> well, uh, I hope you came up with a plan for that one. Oh, hey. I thought you were dead, though you ain't looking like a spring chicken exactly. Holy shit. <laughs> what a dummy. <laughs> there must be no playing with dolls around here. Oh, face sucker.
Well, I'm not down for this. I think I'm going to do the no Prima Doll route and make a Noble Sacrifice. You're not getting no Relic Power out of me. Uh, not great. Now maybe, finally, that guy will shut the hell up, right? Uh, I don't, I, I don't think so. Were you even listening, Rue? Come on. I didn't do this whole big villain thing for nothing. Good lord. Oh, another fade out to white. More talky talk coming. Great. <laughs> and another PowerPoint slide. This is the this is our uh, next talking point. Hey, I remember that box. Aha! Just as I suspected. From having played this game once before and vaguely remembering some things about it. Oh, man. That is a heck of a Dan Man's float, Rue. Mm, I bet he's a lot of fun at the pool. Yeah. Keyword, it is what destroyed it. Not me. Not my fault. I wash my hands of this. It is not my thing. This is your thing. It ain't mine. I got a thing. You got a thing. Everybody's got a thing. And this ain't my thing. I got some duty for you. Some duty in my pants. I'm going to smear it all over your face. Because you suck, Dollmaster. You sure like saying that word, don't you? Duty. Duty. Fate. Duty. 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 Threads of duty. What the fuck ever. Who cares? Oh, no. Don't bring him over here. He has a weird chin. I don't like him. <laughs> this isn't good. <laughs> Please, no. Yeah. <laughs> that's a word he's gotten used to saying. Well, now that's just denial. Of course. You think you have hair that cool being a human? I don't think so. But if I combine my memory with your powers, maybe we got something. Uh-oh. Oh, he's about to do something cool, isn't he? Duke? Is that you? Well, it's not exactly a you are my father reveal, but... Then again, this game is all about the light. Kefka Light just did a Darth Vader reveal light. And this episode has been light on action. Now that's what you call early onset doll Alzheimer's, or Dollsheimer's, I guess. Yeah, I think it's actually I think it's just a tattoo on your head. I think you got suckered on that one. Yes, cuz your head thing is way cooler. Just let me do my villain thing and I'll explain it. God. Well, I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> Don't you remember that awesome insurance payout? The reason you were able to travel around the world forever? Yeah, humans, am I right? <laughs> calm, well, <laughs> calm your tits there, Mr. Righteous Indignation. Oh, well, uh. Well, 
no, that kind of matters. That's what... Rue. I'm trying to fix things here. Come on. Cut a guy a break. All this me killing you and using your power and using you as a pawn to get the relic? That was an accident! Duh! Uh, yeah, man, siblings. Blood is thicker than water. Now give me a fist bump and we'll put this all behind us. But Rue has something better. He has the power of his convictions. Well, if you're concerned about one little wimpy person, then uh then I guess I'm just guess I'm just gonna have to throw you aside. Like a dirty sweater. Oh Oh, you cheesed him off now. Yeah, alright, fine. I can do it myself, it's cool. Oh, yeah. Do you, do you not forget? Well, he does have a weird habit of coming back through the floor every now and then. Yeah, I don't think... Uh, well, he didn't do it once. Why would he do it the second time? What, you're just going to leave me out here in space? You jerk? Are we, uh, are we done here? Do I get to leave space? Well, yeah, I guess I get to leave space. Well, I got the raw end of that deal, that's for sure. Uh, I was going to say, that's a pretty ceiling, but uh, let's not stare at it all day here. Whoa. Man. That was a hell of a nap. Oh, he left behind his mask. I bet I would look pretty cool in this thing. It's better than my dumb hat, that's for sure. Some bad ish is going to go down. Don't they know it's the end of the world? It ended when he got the relic. It's just a dumb book now. Who gives a shit about normal books? We only care about magic books. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this isn't good. I think we need to evacuate Pronto Tonto. We need to evacuate and call it quits for today. Um, that's not a good storm. I don't like the sound of that one bit. Although it put an even cooler... Whoa! Check out Disco Tower 1.0 there. <laughs> oh, that's pretty sweet looking. You know what? I don't really mind the Tower of Mine gone if it leads to that. Talk about a sweet fucking entrance. Go, buddy. Oh, man. Well. Alright. Prepare for landing and things are about to get bad. I know, man. I'm psyched. <laughs> Accompany you. <laughs> You're funny. We'll take care of things down here on Earth. Welcome back to Earth. You go to Valen. Boy, I don't really feel like we got that good a sense of her. She's like the coolest master yet. But, uh, I got a thing. You know, right? Is she seriously going to seppuku herself out of here for being around for like half an hour? That's no good. Yeah, names. Ugh. You should never give them names. That's how they get attached. Curiel. Man, a hot name to go with a hot bod. I pray we will meet again as well. 
I actually like their real names better. Hey, hey, I have a name. Of course. Uh, Brad. That's what I, that's the one I gave you, right? Oh, okay. Oh, Narcius is Trimaster. Okay, whoops. <laughs> All right. Ruishan. Oh, how? Cheap shot. You can't take my name and just put more letters on it, you doofus. Thanks for a fat lot of nothing. Well, they're saying farewell. They're going up to Valence Fortress. I think that's a good place for us to say farewell to. So I will see you guys. Well, we're back at Corona anyway, so that is it for us. Hey, Maya, welcome to Corona. Enjoy your stay. My goodness, it's brimming with noise. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, um, I have a, I have to go there, over there now. And also the inn, it's the only way to recover. And the shop, it's the only way to get new equipment. Well, I mean, uh, I've got this far. Might as well, right? Well, whatever. Okay. No. There is better armor at the shop. You can do this. Alright. Sounds like a good plan to me. I'm going to law school. Yeah, you might, but, you know, that's just the price you pay sometimes. Chicken and waffles is the best thing ever. Yeah, you have fake feelings. Nobody cares. That is true. That is a good point. Well, and also the gate. There, it's probably on the menu of the gate there, once we leave there. Well, that thing is just hanging out up in the sky, being an ugly eyesore. Tickets are 100 coins apiece. Get your tickets now, and that is it for us. Uh, Maya, you know, there's a nice hotel over here. You're a princess. Why don't you go uh, shack up there? I'm going to go see Kartha, and I'll see you guys next time as we go to Valen's Fortress and get our in-game on. <laughs> All right.